we're going to talk about the point system now. So every day, you're going to want to go to Daily Points Tracker. And it'll be available on phones, too, because the website is phone friendly, so it's easy to do from your phone. We want to know your first name, your last name, and the day and date that the points are for, simply because it helps us keep track if we have to backlog or someone questions their total score, we can go back and say, well, on this date, you gave us this many points. Or, we never got a score for you on this date. You know, we're sorry, it wasn't entered. Okay? And due by noon the next day. So, challenge starts on the 15th. We need your score by, the 16th, by noon on the 16th. Okay? It's gonna ask you questions to keep it simple. Did you eat at least one non-starchy vegetable with every meal today? Yes, one, no, zero. Did you eat only or did you eat only organic meats, dairy, eggs, or wild cut seafood today? Yes, one point, no, zero points. Did you eat only organic apples, grapes, strawberries, and leafy greens today? Yes, one, no, zero. Okay, and then were all of your meals balanced with carbs, fat, protein? Okay, so you get the gist. For the positive, you get a point for yes and a point for no. A zero points for no. For the negative stuff. Did you eat any added sugar today? No, one point. Yes, zero points. Okay, so it changes based on the no or the yes roll. Did you eat any fried foods today? No, one point. Yes, zero points. Did you eat any sore corn, soy, corn, wheat, rice, unless organic and sprouted today? No, one point. Yes, zero points. And we'll add any more, any more than one organic and sprouted, just to make sure that when you read it, you'll that bowl will be back in front of you. Again, any foods made with corn canola, corn, canola, or soy. So we have a bonus point. So like I said, we're trying to push the nutrient-dense foods. Vegetables are the most nutrient-dense food out there. So we're going to give you a bonus of one point for any day that you eat seven or more cups of not the non-starchy vegetables. Okay? That, again, falls under the non-starchy clause. So any day you get seven or more cups, like I said, there's going to be a video on what counts as a cup. Then you get an extra bonus for that day. All right? And then just like we want to promote those positive foods, we're trying to really help you avoid the not-so-health-promoting foods. So for sugar, if you have more than one food that contains sugar, you do end up losing two points, OK? Not just one. What we want to avoid is someone saying, well, I had like syrup with my pancakes, so I'm going on a sugar binge all day. You know, you're gonna at least lose two points. We're not gonna do more than that, but at least two. And the same thing for alcohol. If you've had more than one alcohol beverage, two points, okay? So again, you can't lose more than two, so you technically could still go on a binge, but we wanted to make it hurt just a little bit more if you had a sugar binge or you had an alcohol binge, okay? And we wanted to help you out a little bit more if you really were trying to incorporate more vegetables. So that's why we have our bonus and our double negative. Okay, so I'm sure we'll take a brief break video-wise, and then we'll open it up for questions. What is he doing? Pause. I don't see a pause? He's being smart. Which one? I don't know. Is that it? I think I'm going to turn it off. Do you see a plane? I can't see anything. Oh, I just knocked the screen all over the place. This one? 